Hello, I have another video for you on origami. Today we're going to be doing the jumping frog. Um, it's kind of cool, you press on their back and they hop, they pull it on their back, that's not good. <laughs> Anyways, you get the idea, <laughs> they, they don't want to, oh that guy did a good jump. Okay. Anyways, let's get rid of these. You get the idea. So we're going to start off with a normal square. Um, you're going to be making a balloon base again. Um, I pre-folded this just to make the video a little bit shorter. So once you have your balloon base, which looks like this, we're going to start off by taking one of these flaps, folding it to the center line, folding it up to the center line. So it looks like that. Fold that up. Do the same thing on the other side. Make sure your creases are really strong. And you're going to continue folding that in to the center with the next flap. Like that. So it comes out, goes in like that. Same thing on the other side. And you'll finish the front so it looks something like that. So you started here, you folded it in to the center there, there. And continued in, so it looks like that. So you're going to turn that over. Now instead of folding it up, you're going to fold the, the next flaps down along that center line. So it looks like that. You can do the same thing on the other side. So have something that looks like that. So instead of folding that in now, we're going to fold this next flap out. Like that. So from the center line, you're going to fold out so it's flush along that other line right there. And do the same thing on the other side. So we have something like that. So you were there, and you folded these two out. They were flush like that. So you have a front that looks like that, and the back that looks like that. So now you're basically done. All you have to do is put the fold in his back so you can make him hop. Um, you're going to go about halfway, oh, okay, I'd say a little bit further than halfway down. Make your first fold backwards. Make sure it's, it's fairly straight. So you have something that looks like that. Just folded. You're going to make your next fold basically about where that line is, just a little bit in front of that line, because when you're trying to make them hop, you want your finger to be able to, to push off the back without hitting the back of his butt there. And you're done. So that's your, that's your jumping frog. Give it a few little good creases, and just boom. And you're done. Hope you enjoyed it. Um, if you have any questions or comments, leave them in the box below. And I'll see you next time. Ciao.